Eugene Fisher, the founder of Fisher Industries, lived by a simple yet noble philosophy. Do your job, do it right, and be proud of what you do. Exhibiting a tireless work ethic, Fisher was born and raised in Dickinson, North Dakota. He found a love for the aggregate industry at an early age, even skipping his high school picnic so he could screen gravel. It's no surprise then that in 1952 at 24, Fisher started Fisher Sand and Gravel Company. Ultimately, Fisher built his company into one of the largest producers of sand and gravel in the United States. Colleagues and employees admired Fisher, who died in 2013, for his leadership and willingness to teach. He continuously made time to explain how things worked, and he was one who worked alongside his employees. Fisher never asked someone to do a task he wasn't willing to do himself, and he embraced challenges, treating them as opportunities. Among Fisher's greatest achievements was the establishment of General Steel and Supply Company, the equipment support arm to Fisher's sand and gravel. Not only did General Steel and Supply serve as a place where Fisher could customize his own equipment, but it was somewhere producers like him could turn for answers to their own painful production problems. Perhaps the most groundbreaking solution Fisher provided was the Fisher Air Separator. Using his ingenuity and problem-solving skills, Fisher curtailed water shortages by patenting his own classification system. The signature piece of General Steel and Supply, the Fisher Air Separator, helps to remove fine particulates from manufactured sand using air instead of water. Fisher was highly dedicated to his work, regularly seeking reading materials, attending equipment auctions, and drawing up new crushing and screening configurations. But Fisher also had a softer side. He enjoyed traveling and, toward the end of his life, spending time with his grandchildren. A veteran who served in the Korean War, Fisher was proud to have served his country. He took great pride in his local community, as Fisher Industries serves as local sponsors to organizations like the Boy and Girl Scouts of America, Relay for Life, Walk to End Alzheimer's, and United Way. Today, Fisher Industries is in its second generation of ownership, under the direction of Fisher's son, Tommy. Growing up, Tommy had aspirations of being a rock star. Before passing the company down, Gene told his son, you're a star, all right, but it's with rock crushing. Fisher Industries currently employs more than 1,000 people, serving as one of the greatest legacies for the ambitious quarry man from North Dakota.